Sometimes you have an STL file with holes in it that you want to close up. This can be done in Mesh Mixer. You get better results with flat pieces instead of curved ones, but you can still close the holes up on both. To do so, select the inside of the hole. The entire inside needs to be selected. If you inadvertently select other parts as I just did, hold the shift key down to deselect them. Orbit around the entire piece to make sure you're removing all selected parts that you don't want selected. Once you've selected the interior of the hole, press the delete key to remove it. Then go to analysis, inspector, auto repair all, and it fixes the hole. Now I'll do this curved piece. I'll select the inside. Putting a transparent shader on might make this easier. Hold the shift key down and Deselect what I don't need. And now I'll press delete. Analysis, inspector, auto repair. And it closed up that hole too with a faint trace of where it was. If that faint trace bothers you, you could try reducing the polygon count of the model first and then closing the hole. However, if I put the clear shader on it, I can see that the hole has disappeared from the interior. And that's how you close a hole up in Mesh Mixer.